Daniel Radcliffe has shared new remarks on Harry Potter author J.K. Rowling after the pair publicly displayed their opposing views on the trans debate. Rowling, who of late has been involved in public spats with trans newsreader India Willoughby, has for years argued her belief in the importance of biological sex. The Edinburgh-based author even encouraged police to arrest her following Scotland's rollout of its heavily criticised hate crime bill. Now, in a new interview, Daniel Radcliffe has admitted he hasn't spoken to J.K. Rowling in years and branded the fallout over their trans views as sad. The 34-year-old said, It makes me really sad, ultimately because I do look at the person that I met and the times that we met and the books that she wrote, the world that she created, all of that to me is so deeply empathic. When referring back to his initial opposition to Rowling's trans remarks back in 2020, Radcliffe claimed it would have shown immense cowardice not to have spoken out against the 58-year-old. He added to The Atlantic, I wanted to try and help people that had been negatively affected by the comments, and to say that, if those are Joe's views, then they are not the views of everybody associated with the Potter franchise. Radcliffe's opposition to Rowling's stance comes following his work with the non-profit charity The Trevor Project, an American-based organisation that focuses on suicide prevention efforts amongst lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender and queer youngsters. When Radcliffe first spoke out about Rowling's social media, Radcliffe said via the organisation in 2020 that transgender women are women. Any statement to the contrary erases the identity and dignity of transgender people and goes against all advice given by professional health care associations who have far more expertise on this subject matter than either Joe or I. Radcliffe wasn't the only actor from the Harry Potter film to speak out against Rowling's views when her comments first hit headlines back in 2020. Ron Weasley star Rupert Grint said in a statement at the time, I firmly stand with the trans community. Trans women are women. Trans men are men. We should all be entitled to live with love and without judgment. Emma Watson, who completed the iconic trio of child actors from the Harry Potter films, also agreed with her fellow actors. J.K. Rowling's representatives have been contacted by GB News for comment regarding Radcliffe's latest remarks. Daniel Smith, GB News.